Penny here, ghostpixats.com, the number one sports consultant in the business. Got a snow day up in here in Pennsylvania. Starting to snow. We're going to get some ice on top of it. It's going to be one of those yucky days. Uh, you know how it is. Extra tired today, too. Just polished off my second coffee. Looking to get that energy. Looking to get wild. It's Wednesday, February 20th. Let's get wild. You know how we do. $9.99 gets you all plays for the day. That's any handicapper you choose. And $99.99 gets you a full week of Benny. A full week of the Ben Dog. Last day, because tomorrow starts the extended weekend bendo with the extendo. So it's the last day to hop on the $99 week with Benny. I will have a link in the description below. Hey, if you're new to my page, welcome. Hop on down to that subscribe. Give your boy Benny a subscribe. Thumbs up for the hard work we're doing over here, right? Having fun over here. Tap the bell right next to so you get my videos as soon as they pop up and then head on over to Facebook. Head on over to Instagram. Start following along over there. We have free content from all five handicappers every single day. You can't see me. And then follow along over on Twitter as well, at Benny Bistro. Peace be the journey. Where to start? Talk about being humbled, huh? All right? Go 3-1 and one in college basketball on Monday. Feel like we have a good grasp on the ball, and boom. Just like that, our whole world is flipped on its head. Went 2-3 and three in college basketball on Tuesday. 0-2 oh top tier. The dogs were barking. Other than Buffalo, ranked teams did not cover on Tuesday. They went 1-5 against the spread on Tuesday for ranked teams, all right? Regardless of the trending or injuries on teams like Baylor, you know, sports are just unpredictable. It's an imperfect science, and that what that is what makes it beautiful to me. You know what I mean? That's what makes it beautiful to the Ben Dog. Anything can happen, baby. Shouts to Maribel, uh, Maribel Ramirez in the comments. Need to regroup and get back to work, and that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm not shying away. I'm rolling with the punches. Shouts to you, Maribel. Um, speaking of rolling with the punches, we have UFC this weekend, all right? We will have more to come on that it's going to be in Prague first time ever I believe and so it's going to be early on Saturday just keep that in mind prelims are at 11 a.m eastern time main card starts at 2 p.m eastern time plays will be out late Friday night or early Saturday morning but we like we we like to wait you know to, to hear how weight cuts and uh camp went I'll have more info coming at you as we get closer here all right but let's talk about Tuesday for a sec free play on Rhode Island Blowout loser. Betty, you dumb dick. You blowout loser. Possibly the worst blowout loser I've had. I can't remember the last one like it. Uh, I mean, there's no excuse for it. There's no, if this would have happened, we could have won. Or if that would have happened, we could have won. Or the refs. There, there's just no excuse. When you get blown out like that, there's only one thing you can do. Own it. That's the only thing you can do. You take it right on the chin, accept that it's unpredictable and that it's ha that it does happen and we move right along, right? Humbling, humbling loss for sure, but we're right back at it. Hey, VCU is good. Everything pointed towards VCU. I felt it was a spot to go oppo. I felt it was a spot to go opposite, but Rhode Island, just not good right now. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, uh, they've been inconsistent. That's my bad on the free pick. I own it. We're right back at it today, all right? I own that pick. Had a top-tier play on Purdue. They did not cover. As a matter of fact, they're lucky that they even won the game. Purdue minus six. The dogs were barking. Indiana came to play. Three-unit premium win on Iona on the money line. The line was bopping all over the place. Plus one, minus one. Pick them. I was just confident in Iona to get the job done, which they did. 81 to 77 over Quinnipiac. And then, ugh. Top tier play on Iowa State, minus 10, and they lost outright. I'm telling you, it was just one of those days for me. Baylor had injuries. Iowa State at home. Easy money, right? Wrong. That's why we never say a play is easy money. Never. No easy picks in sports betting, right? Baylor, 18 to 8 advantage on offensive rebounds in this game. Iowa State has now had two home losses in a row. Very unexpected. They're not a tough team right now. They're not tough enough right now. Uh, they need to get tougher, period. Honestly, I think they dropped out of contention to win the Big 12 with that loss. And uh, 18 offensive rebounds for Baylor. 
Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Then Iowa was our third loss in uh, college basketball. We had Iona, Iowa, Iowa State. It's Iowa, Iona, Iowa State. But anyway, yeah, Iowa was our third loss in college basketball. Premium play on Iowa minus two. They lost by one, all right? I did make one good call on the night. Initially, this was not on my package, but we saw some reverse line movement, and I pushed out Vanderbilt plus 17 and a half for a nice win. Got four, unit, four units back on that play. Vanderbilt lost 58 to 46. It was actually a, a single-digit game, a lot of the game, low scoring, and uh, got a nice win on Vanderbilt against Tennessee, all right? And then soccer. Had a play on Liverpool to win the match. Multiple attempts. Their stars just missed. Can't buy a basket. You know what I'm saying? Match ended 0-0 zero to zero in a draw. And with that, we are taking Tuesday on the chin right here. Uh, and on to Wednesday. And we're just going to continue to work hard and do what we do. Wild Wednesday is where you pay 10 bucks, Get any handicapper you choose. Get all plays for the day. Looking for a nice, smooth, bounce back day. Easy going, bounce back day. Yeah, right. Like I said, every day is stressful in this business. Just got to laugh about it, smile about it, and we keep on grinding. It's what we do. We keep plugging away. Shouts to the ghost team. Shouts to Jimmy. He's really heating up over there. His NHL is doing great right now. Shouts to Derek Dimes. Benny got the drip. Dimes provides the sauce. Got to be teaming up with Derek Dimes again in the near future. And then Chase and Jack, they have their duo running. Much love to those guys. Let's get wild. Let's get a free play. 11 p.m. Eastern Time, New Mexico at Utah State. Got a double-digit point spread. Free play of the day will be Utah State minus 14. Utah State is sitting in second in the Mountain West. They're 10 and 3 in conference play, 20 and 6 on the season. They have won 9 of 10. 9 of their last 10. And they're playing good basketball. They just beat Air Force on the road. They were a 10-point favorite in that game. They won by 14. Utah State has won its last three versus New Mexico at home. They're looking for a fourth tonight. Sam Merrill has been explosive. The offense runs through Sam Merrill. All right? Solid defense. They're holding opposing def uh, offenses to a field goal percentage of 38.9%. It's the 11th lowest mark in D1. The home team is 8-0 against the spread in the last eight meetings. Utah State is only 4-10 against the spread in the last 14 games overall. They're 4-10 against the spread in the last 14 versus the Mountain West, but I'm confident they will get the job done here at home versus New Mexico. Utah State has won five of the last six at home by an average margin of 19.2 points per game. New Mexico has lost their last five road games by an average, uh, by an average margin of 18.4 points per game. Mexico has allowed opponents to shoot 45% through 25 games, which is good for 253rd in the rankings. New Mexico is 4-0 against the spread in their last four following an ATS loss. They're 4-1 against the spread in their last five following a straight-up loss. They just lost to Fresno State on Saturday by eight. I'm going with the hot team today. I'm going with the hot team at home. I don't expect a 25-30 to 30 point win, but they should win enough to cover the higher line. Free play of the day will be Utah State minus 14. Let's get back at it, guys. Took a took one on the chin on Tuesday. Let's get wild on Wednesday. Link is in the description. Come rock with Benny. Come rock with Ghost Picks. $9.99 today. Come give us a look. Get linked up. UFC this weekend. It's early on Saturday. Keep that in mind. And then today is the last day to hop on my full week. It's $99.99. The link will be listed below. As always, guys, good luck. God bless. Grind on, baby. Cheers.